Hey guys, Sally here, and today I'm gonna talk about Mega Beast Investigator Jespian. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. Before I talk about this show, I have a few announcements that I first want to make. For example, if you want to support me financially, I have both PayPal.com and Patreon.com. I also have various social media accounts on Facebook, Minds.com, and of course, Twitter.com. You're probably thinking to yourself, well, geez, Tyler, what is Just Bien and what is the history behind the show? The answer to that is very simplistic. Just Bien is just one of many shows that is part of the Metal Heroes franchise. And the Metal Hero franchise essentially is a series of shows in which the protagonist is actually a robot or like a cyborg or whatever fighting against giant monsters. And the most famous example in the United States of the Metal Hero franchise is of course a show that is called VR Troopers. Just like Power Rangers before it, VR Troopers combine various different shows into one show and Americanize it for the American audience. Before somebody asked me if whether or not Saban Entertainment was behind the show for VR Troopers, well yes, yes they were. They were also behind like the show for Power Rangers and also the Americanized version of Kamen Rider. However, to my knowledge, the rights for Kamen Rider, the rights to Power Rangers, and the rights to VR Troopers are now at Hasbro Entertainment. To my knowledge, this release of Just Bien is the first time ever that any show within the Metal Hero franchise has ever gotten an official release onto Blu-ray or DVD. Like prior to this release, of course, like Shout Factory tested out these kind of grounds with their Super Sentai DVDs. And of course, the DVDs were successful. And so by supporting this release from Discotech Media for this show, Just Bien, essentially, depending on how successful the show is on home video, they're probably going to license out more shows within the franchise. And so by buying this release, it kind of signalized that. This Blu-ray set from Discotech Media has all 46 episodes on one disc. Essentially, you'll get a standard Blu-ray case and a slip cover for the Blu-ray case. And of course, when you flip it around, it has a description and the speculations for the Blu-ray disc. And of course, when you open up the Blu-ray case, it has the Blu-ray disc and it has all the episodes on one disc. The plot for this show is very hard to explain into words. However, I'll try my best in this video. Essentially what happens is that a guy named Jespian goes into outer space, he has a spaceship with an android, and essentially they go from planet to planet to fight monsters. Essentially it's like Ultraman, but on crack. And it's like the good kind of crack, like all these monster fights are ridiculous, like the story is just over the top. Like if you guys like stuff like Ultraman and Johnny Sacco, that kind of stuff, and Godzilla, you'll definitely will love to watch this show. I heard that this show was very popular in Brazil. As a matter of fact, I heard that there's like a movie coming up in Brazil based upon this show. That's kind of how popular the show is in Brazil to my knowledge. As far as the picture quality for the Blu-ray set, all the episodes are presented in standard definition. And of course, I'm not surprised about that. Mostly because it seems as though like a lot of shows in the past, they were filmed in that kind of way. And so it's not a negative against the film quality or the video quality for the Blu-ray. And also, it's kind of neat that all 46 episodes could fit a Blu-ray disc. Mostly because DVD sets nowadays, they have like so many discs for the episodes. And so basically they have it on one disc. It's very convenient to me. Another cool aspect about this release is the fact that Discotech Media actually used fan subtitles for the official release of this show. Essentially, they borrowed the subtitles from Mega Beast Empire and essentially used that as the official subtitles. And they also managed to credit the people behind the subtitles. That's pretty cool that they actually used subtitles that they thought that were accurate to use on the official release. Overall, I recommend this Blu-ray release. 
If you like kaiju movies, if you like Godzilla, if you like Ultraman and other tokusatsu shows, I highly recommend this show. But what do you guys think about this show? Tell me in the comment section down below. And I'll talk to you guys next time. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. He's your only black friend, so he's your best black friend. I wouldn't trade him for another black friend. Because black friends are rare, as you should be aware. He smiles like Richard Pryor, so just sit and stare. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler.